Hi, Brentek here, where tech is made simple. Yesterday, I let you know that the global media controls were back again in the stable version of Microsoft Edge, which seems to be on a controlled rollout because not everyone was seeing this, and I only received this on one of my devices and not both. I'll leave the video linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like some more information. Now, although this is a very handy feature, which I actually find quite useful, and so do others, obviously there are some users who would prefer not to have the global media controls for whatever reason. Maybe they just don't want the clutter or don't find it useful. Then just a quick video to show you how you can actually disable the new global media controls because there is no setting in the browser to actually turn it off. So it's opens up by default whenever you play media in the browser. So if you don't want the new global media controls, this is how we're going to do it. Now, what we have to do, and by the way, this was pointed out to me by a viewer of this channel, which once again, I'm always grateful for. And what we have to do is we have to enable a command line flag. So I'm just going to take you through that process if you don't know how to do that. So this is the command line flag, and it's quite a mouthful. So I'll leave it linked down below in the description for you to copy and paste for easy access and reference. So what we need to do is we need to right click on any shortcut of Edge, be that in your start menu, desktop or taskbar like um, I have mine. You click on properties once you've right clicked and then here you'll see the target. What you need to do is to the right of .exe quotations you need to delete, if there is something there, you need to delete anything that's to the right of .exe quotations. And then what you need to do is you need to leave a space and then paste that command line flag in. Take note, you need to have that space there because if it isn't there, this won't work. And then what you do is you click on Apply, click on OK. And then what I would suggest is close the browser, relaunch Microsoft Edge, and now you will see if we head back to a video as an example, just to play some media. You will see that there is no global media controls now showing in the toolbar. So that has removed it. Now this is a command line flag and flags are not options. They are experiments. So that command line flag may be removed by Microsoft at any given time. But at the date and day of posting this video, 6th of June, 2025, this works. And if you do have a change of mind and you want to put everything back to normal, what you would do is you would just go through the same process, right click on the shortcut, properties, and this time you would just once again delete everything to the right of .exe quotations. Click on apply, click on OK. Close Edge, relaunch the browser, and now if we play some media once again, there's our global media controls back again in the toolbar. So, so you have the option to return everything back to how it was prior to enabling the command line flag, which I always think is great. And at this stage, as I mentioned yesterday, go check the video out if you want more info. Not known if this is rolling out now as a default feature because Microsoft has been known in the past to roll it out, pull it, roll it out, kind of a backwards and forwards process. So it'll be interesting to see if this does remain. But I'll keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.